Hi, this is Natalie. I'm writer of BaggageReclaim.com. When you are confronted with uh, somebody who is your ex and they are trying to be your friend, and by friend I use that term loosely, uh, whether it's actually a subcode for keeping their foot in your life or trying to basically get all the fringe benefits of the relationship without actually having to do the work that comes along with that, it is really important to uh, make sure that you don't basically marginalize yourself and get yourself demoted. There are a lot of people that I hear from that used to be the girlfriend or the boyfriend and now they are the booty call. Why? Because they decided that they really, really wanted to keep this person in their life because they're, you know, we were such good friends. We had such a good relationship. And so by trying to keep somebody in your life who actually probably doesn't have enough love, care, trust and respect for you, you've ended up into this pseudo friendship where you're breaking them off a piece of sex from time to time. You're allowing them to step up in your life and get in the way of you actually moving on. Somebody who is not, doesn't make a great boyfriend or girlfriend isn't really very likely to make a great friend. There are exceptions to this. And that is where there probably was friendship in the first place or where you realized actually that you were better off as friends. But if you broke up because the person was an asshole, then trust me, they'll be an asshole as a friend as well. Don't go there. Make sure that you know the difference between friends and really not such a great friend. Don't allow yourself to be played down by anybody. Don't allow people to take advantage and creep in and take from you what under ordinary circumstances you would, you would only do if you were in a bona fide committed relationship.